signs that your dog is dying. Don't forget to share this video with someone you know who wants to know about it. One prolonged lethargy and disinterest. A dog sleeps an average of 12 or 14 hours a day, so it's not uncommon to see him rested for a long time. However, if the animal does not respond to the stimuli that previously made it jump for joy, something may really be wrong physiologically. Another clear indication of approaching death is the dog resting in a place where it was not previously. 2. Loss of appetite. Loss of appetite in dogs is often caused by anxiety, depression, separation stress, and some illnesses. This anorexia can be partial or total, which largely determines the severity of the clinical picture. A prolonged lack of desire to eat can be a sign of failure of various organs in the animal, which can lead to death. 3. Incontinence. Urinary incontinence in senior dogs is very common and can be caused by several factors. Over time, the muscles around the animal's urinary system weaken and its nervous control over certain parts of the body may diminish. Therefore, it is normal for him to urinate outside of his walks or in places where he did not do this before. Incontinence itself is not a clinical sign that a dog is going to die. In any case, if it suddenly appears with any of the above-mentioned symptoms, it may indicate that the dog does not have much time to live. For atypical breathing, unusual breathing and continuous coughing could be an indication that the dog is dying. In some cases, these behaviors indicate that the body's homeostatic balance has been disrupted, causing the lung alveoli to become flooded with fluid. At this point, if the animal is elderly, the prognosis is very poor. 5. Vomiting. When an animal is close to death, it is usually unable to digest its food properly. This will cause you to vomit, which in turn will promote the weakness and dehydration typical of a serious illness. If a dog repeatedly vomits and is not able to keep the food bolus in its stomach, it may not live much longer. 6. Dependent behaviors. As devastating as it may seem, a dog that is close to death may require affection and attention from its owner. After all, he is the figure that the animal trusts the most and, therefore, will look for his human reference to be able to lead this world with tranquility and peace. Death causes fear in all living beings. You have to be strong and take care of the animal. 7. Seizures. Focal seizures are caused by abnormal electrical activity in the brain, which may be preceded by severe trauma, intoxication, drug use, brain tumors, low blood sodium, and other physiological imbalances. Unfortunately, some of these pathologies lead to the death of the animal. 8. Changes in the color of the gums. A whitish or gray color on a dog's gums is a sign of serious illness. For some reason, the blood is not reaching the organs correctly, a fact that is evident in the animal's mouth tissue. Some of the common causes are anemia, internal bleeding, low blood pressure, and other conditions. 9. Loss of coordination. This is one of the signs that the dog is going to die. When the animal's nervous system fails, it can have trouble getting up, bumping into walls, and moving in an uncoordinated manner. This is usually indicative of a serious condition. 10. Irritability. Dogs are still animals, and therefore, in their last moments of life, instinct can take over. If a dog has any of the above-mentioned symptoms and does not allow them to approach him, it could be because he feels that his life is threatened and he does not want anyone to hurt him in his last moments. The end of the road. The death of a dog is the end of the animal's path, but not yours. Say goodbye to your pet. Take your time. Cry and suffer as much as necessary. Grief is part of recovery. So there's nothing wrong with being vulnerable after the loss of a loved one. Over time, you will see how the pain turns into memory, longing, and good feelings. In the end, what remains are the positive experiences, so your dog will always accompany you in your memory despite having disappeared on the physical plane.